What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Lamont Tyson, host of the Life Gains channel. And I'm back taking a question from a Life Gains subscriber. Subscriber's name is Nick. And Nick says, Lamont, I am starting a fitness and muscle building program. I would like to know, how can you tell if someone is natty or not because I'm determining who I want to use on YouTube to follow. Sign Nick. <laughs> okay, Nick. When I read that email, the first thing I thought to myself was, what difference does it make? And then I had to remember the thoughts going through my head when I first got into health and fitness and wanting to change my body. And I also thought about the way I felt when I was a young Lamont Tyson, when I saw this guy say I could look like him and be a real American hero if I just do this. Train, say your prayers, eat your vitamins, be true to yourself, treat your country, be a real American. If you was born in the 80s, did you fall for the okie doke? <laughs> I know I did. I ate so many Flintstone vitamins, I said my prayers, I did my push ups, and 25 years later, I still don't look like him. So in order to sufficiently answer the question, how do you know someone's using performance enhancers or if they're natural, I think it's only fair that you guys see the bodies of people that have either been caught using performance enhancers or have stated themselves that they use performance enhancers. So take a look at the physiques of people that have either been caught or been using performance enhancers. Take a look. Okay, so you guys saw varying degrees of physiques and what they look like after using enhancers. And to cut this whole thing short, the real answer to your question, Nick, is there is really no way to tell if someone is using or not. Unless you have a personal relationship with that person, you live with that person, you're around them 24-7, you have no idea who's using and who's not using. You can only go by their word. And we both know in American capitalism, sometimes your word ain't your bond. The best thing I can tell you and anyone else that's watching this video is, if you're gonna engage in that behavior, which I'm not a proponent of it, because of the long-term effects of what happens when you use those things, know what you're doing. Um, really consider the long-term effects of using performance enhancers. Um, some of those long-term effects have been noted as far as um, catastrophic injuries, injuries to the heart, blah, blah, blah. Um, and when you come off of them, from what I've read and seen, it makes it harder to get back in shape and you're not going to retain all those gains. And so my thing to anyone who's getting into health and fitness, you need to know the risks. You need to understand that you want to concentrate more on what it is that you can do for yourself to make your physique look the best. Whichever route you go, just know the risk. And again, you will not know who's using it and who's not. As long as the body looks right, it's going to sell tickets and we live in a society where that works. So guys, don't forget to like this video, comment and subscribe, go out there and get yourself a life game. And whatever you decide to do is a personal choice, but just know the outcomes. Catch you on the next one.